is Dr. N.K. Narayanan, Apollo Hospital, Chennai. On this World Diabetes Day 2022, the theme for today is access to diabetes education for all, which means people across the spectrum in the society should be able to access all types of educational materials for their treatment of type 2 diabetes and type 1 diabetes. So with regards to this, many innovations have made the life of patients with diabetes much easier. And I'm just going to mention a couple of such devices which people might have come across. We know that people with diabetes, whether it's type 1 or type 2, they have to monitor their glucose on a regular basis. And uh, the commoner device that people use at home is the glucometer, which is the small machine which they use to pin prick at their finger prick and they get the glucose values. Obviously, the discomfort being the pain of pricking themselves. So the innovation that has come across is something called a continuous glucose monitoring. The more recent innovation in this is called a flash glucose monitoring. Essentially, this has got a sensor which gets stuck onto the arm like this here. It's a small coin-like device which goes on for 14 days of recording. The big advantage is that the reading can be obtained by just showing this reader, which is a small device across to the coin-like device here. So they don't have to print themselves multiple times. Automatically, the values get uh, displayed on the monitor here. Because they don't have to prick themselves, people will be willing to test multiple times. And this will be a big boom for people with the type 1 diabetes where close monitoring is very important. People who have got pregnancy sugar where the close monitoring is important. So another innovation which has made the patient's life easier is in the field of insulin injections. People with type 1 diabetes especially where they have to inject insulin multiple times a day. Obviously, it's a painful thing. And this device, which is the insulin pump, has made their life easier. Some of us might have come across this device where the insulin gets stored in here and this little tube goes and gets stuck onto the body part and uh, it infuses the insulin gradually. The big advantage with this is you can get a very good control, very tight control of the glucose levels and the more recent advance with the insulin pump is called a smart insulin pump where this is attached or this is coupled with a sensor in the body, the sensor will automatically detect the glucose values and sends it across to the insulin pump. Therefore, these are intelligent devices where automatically it will infuse the glucose, the in insulin infusion based on the glucose values. And if the glucose levels were going to drop, if it's going to go low, automatically it will shut off the insulin infusion also. And they have got alarms inside which can detect high and low values. And uh, this is as close as we can get possible to the innate pancreas that the people have. So we call this as a closed loop. More innovations are in its way, which will make patients' life much, much easier in the future.